All right, and we're back. And I swear every time I sit on this stupid chair... Oh, it's just an old chair, so it's not surprising that the thing slides down every now and then. Anyways, last episode we left off. Well, we beat a monster in the Misty Mountains. Geet wouldn't listen to Moses when he told him to stop eating it, and... Well, now apparently there's a problem with... Geet, and we need to rush over to Will's house. What's the problem? Well, we'll find out. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's this way to Will's, right? Yep, taking a while, so must mean cutscene. Well, not cutscene, but... Yeah, whatever. Please settle down. We understand what you're saying. Please, let me handle the situation. What we want you to do is show us the big golf that was with that guy. Everyone in town has seen them together. You can't talk your way out of this. What's going on? People from the city were attacked by a pack of monsters. According to the people who were attacked, a golf that looked like Geet was leading the pack. And that's what caused this commotion? If you don't have anything to hide, then why don't you just show us the golf? Yeah, exactly! Oh, that was a woman. Oh well. I'll just read them. <clears throat> Where's Geet now? Nobody's seen him since last night. That's not good. I'll take personal responsibility in, yeah, in investigating this matter. Please accept that for now. But we... Do you not trust me? It's not that. Then please break this up for now. Go on about your business. It's just as I'd feared. Even ordinary citizens are being threatened. It wasn't Geet. I guess that monster we defeated in the Misty Mountains had nothing to do with this. Do y'all really think Geet did it? Seno, are you saying you don't trust me and Geet? No one's saying that. Moses, calm down. We understand that you want to trust Geet, but right now we don't have any proof of his innocence. We'll have to take out the monster that attacked the townspeople. Chopper's been getting information about that right now. We have Jay working as well. I'm sure we'll locate it soon. Moses, listen to me. We want to trust Geet, too. We've been together all this time, after all. Sorry, I let myself get all worked up. <laughs> that smile's just... Too weird. Moses, we found it. Where? On the opposite bank of Raging Bay, in the crags. <gasps> Excuse me. There's a pack of monsters hiding there. Let's go tell the others. Time for the slow everyone join the party. There we go. That sped up faster than normal. Sorry, Shirley, but I don't want you in the party. <gasps> Ugh. Oh my god, I've got a hic... It's like, I've got a hiccup... Or a burp or something that's... Stuck in my chest trying to push its way out. And I can't get it out. Oh, okay, I got it. Okay, so... Ah, uh, they'll probably say it here in a second. Let's see, where are we headed to? To the crags. Norma's always so full of energy. Well, it's my job to keep morale high. Gotta do my best. Oh. Okay, so the crags. Is this a place we have a... Nope. 
Okay, so let's see. The crags, where are you at? Way down there. Alright, so what is Orosorn... Okay, so we warped to the Orosorn village. Alright, well obviously you guys will notice that I just cut out half of the crap. It was taking a while, I was getting kind of annoyed, so I ended up just looking up online where to go. Basically, just take the duck to the far shore of the... of Raging Bay or whatever, and then crags are right here. <clears throat> uh, that was obnoxious, trying to find <laughs> this place. I mean, trying to find out how to get here again. Red, what is it? Did you find something? It's nothing. Moses. Red, you're looking kind of scary. He's looked like that ever since we met him. A good point. <clears throat> That's strange. Normally he'd be like... Jay, let's you and me take this outside or something. Let's get moving. Hey, guys, wait up! Uh, what's going on here? I don't know how I should act now. <coughs> oh, yeah. I do remember how this ends now. I'm not going to spoil it, but... Ugh, it stinks. I'll just say that. Oh, that's right. I don't remember this place. This is where we... kind of crashed when we first... When we were kind of first encountering Jay. Okay. This one looks. Uh... You're going down. Oh, Passed it. No. Twin demon. Twin demon. Twin demon. No. Flame Oops. What are you looking at? Run. Get her, Chloe. Or get her, or whatever that thing is. What a jerk. He interrupted my art. Get it? I can say what Will says too. That went tolerably well. Oh. Ooh, that was actually a pretty good experience too. Maybe I should level grind here. <laughs> uh, which way? This way. All right. <clears throat> Not what I, you know, not really what I say I'd go out of the way to grab, but, alright. Actually, what way am I supposed to go here? I'm guessing we're going back to, like, the beginning of the series. Yep, I'm going the right way. What is it? I can't take all this doom and gloom anymore. <clears throat> it's hardly surprising given the situation. Chloe, Norma can't survive if she stays quiet for too long. Exactly, I... Hey! You've always got to be making noise, don't you? Spot's gonna be fine. He and Red are super close. I ain't worried a bit. Then why aren't you being silly and stupid like you usually are? <clears throat> eh. You've been acting strangely ever since we got here. What, you been studying me or something, Jay? It doesn't take that much effort. You're no good at hiding your feelings. <laughs> whatever. You're upset because you suspect Geet, too. 
Now listen. That's enough, you two. <laughs> what, no smack for Norma? If we continue our investigation, we'll eventually find the truth. Throwing around guesses won't bring us any closer to a conclusion. <clears throat> now it's all gloomy again. You'll just have to deal with it for now. Let's do our best, Norma. Charge! Gee, girl, I don't know what I'd do without you. Be slightly less obnoxious? Maybe? Could have done with G-Girl early on in the game, so we wouldn't have been trapped into fighting a fucking... Looks kinda tough. What can we call it? Turn around, Sal. Ah, I hate these things. No, stop! Guard son of guard. What are you up to? I hit you. No. Stop charging, you little prick. Jesus Christ, how much health do you have? Not that much. What the hell? He's just not taking any. No, stop swapping your aim, game. Did he just heal it? It just healed it. Maybe that's why it's had so much health. It's been getting healed. Yeah, I think that's why it was getting healed. Boy, that was adorable. <clears throat> okay, not that way. Eh, that was a shortcut. Ooh. That's actually kind of tempting. It's a different color than they usually are. Eh, I'll ignore it. I wonder what you are! You're a cactus now. That's adorable. <clears throat> Do you have any siblings, Mimi? I've got a brother no named Cup something and a sister named Cornet. Cornet's really cute like me. Um, where to start? Do they act as, well, strangely as you do? What's so strange about the way I act? Stupid people don't even realize how stupid they are, like Moses here. Don't compare me to him. Hey! I've had about enough of this. I'm leaving before I get tart with you. Yep. Wouldn't be Mimi if she didn't trip every time you finish talking to her. I guess it's kind of funny. It was kind of cute the first time it happens. <laughs> Excuse me. Ugh. Oh, that dog. 
Brace yourself. Turn up in the backyard if you're gonna bark, Tony. No! God damn it. Fuck. After this one. No, turn around, Senel. Don't aim at thin air. Fuck. Aim at that one. Come on. Go, Senel. Move, Senel. Oh, you little prick. Jeez, it's like, it's... There, go back over to her. No, oh, don't come over to me. Thank you. I do like that experience, though. Yeah, I think after we finish this episode, I'll probably be around here grinding a bit. Especially since there's the heal spot right there. It's not a bad deal at all. Oh, that's right, and I have dark bottles, too. So I can make grinding even faster. Let's see, what are you? Open. Scallop gel. What do you do again? Actually, I don't really need it, so... I think that's like a health and TP thing. It's like one of those weird ones where you'll get more health or more TP. Uh, yeah, I don't need any health on anyone right now. Uh, do I? Uh, I guess maybe it could be used on Chloe, but... Oh, well. Oh, my God. Really? Okay, go after them, that's fine. Please die before the other thing heals you. There we go. Damn it, Chloe. You know you're obnoxious. Now, kill the big thing. <laughs> I hate that. We're really going to victory. Actually, I'm curious. How much? I have quite a bit of gold. I really should go to the customization shop after this. Need to start, uh, you know, just getting good things in general, or well, better equipment in general. Using like the end main game equipment I've had <laughs> doesn't exactly work so well in the character quests. Oh, there's another heal spot right there. There's nothing here. Are we sure this is the right place? My information network never fails. So if anyone made a mistake, it's us. Chloe's is right. Did you hear something? It almost sounded like some kind of animal. Seems like your ears aren't playing tricks on you. There it 
is again? Where's it coming from? Over there. Here it comes. Spot? Wait, no, it's not. How did you think that's geek? Oh my, it looks like it's in a really bad mood. This is getting exciting. Yeah, this one isn't too obnoxious, but this one it is well it does hit well yeah, it kind of hits hard. And has a lot of health if I remember. Yep, it has a lot of health. And it's weak to earth, huh. Okay, let's see. Lightning off. Indignation. Under blade. Alright, you. Under arrow. Alright. So we're good to go. Oh, wait. Oops, 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 oops. Oops, 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 oops. Norma. We're on a boss, so that's kind of useful. Actually, let's see, let's set Beast back on here. Uh, yeah. God, that's the hard hit. Jesus Christ! There we go. Fling him, Sentinel. We haven't taken <laughs> we haven't taken off much of anything here. Back in the corner again, I it really had that work with me. Oh, oops. I'll just hold on X and have Chloe continually spam her art. Okay, that doesn't work. Final embrace. Uh, it works so much for a little bit. No, Chloe, get back on the other side. No! <laughs> Damn it, Chloe. If it gets freeze lancer. Firestorm! 
Worm Crush! Twin Demon Worm Crush! Spread! Twin Demon! Damn it. Finish this! Was going right. fairly well. Jesus, he still got health there. Look at that. Time it right, I can keep him. Don't take your eyes off him. Crap, I screwed that up. Icicle Volt! No, I screwed it up. There are always interrupt when I put an input in, too. There we go. Ooh, that experience. That is nice. See, that's one of the nice things about... That's one of the things you can do if you don't have the best equipment. If you can get them into the right area and pin them against a wall with the right moves, you can just spam it. If you time the inputs right, you can actually make it so they can never attack, but... Yeah, as you can see, I screw that up pretty easily. Especially when the others start doing their arts and like their little animations interrupt on it. That one must have been the real perpetrator. This will clear Geet's name. You can relax, Moses. You don't look happy. What is it? It ain't over. What do you mean? Just what I said. That wasn't nothing more than a game. I thought you stopped playing hide-and-seek when we were little. Come on out, Geet. Red, what's going on? It would seem that what we see before us is the truth. But, but that's... that's... This time there's no question that's Geet. How can you say that so calmly? Stop carrying on. Don't agitate him. He's acting strangely. Ay, that fucking dog. I swear to God. Ah, close the door. Uh-oh, he's not alone. Leave it to me. You can trust me and Geet. Moses, it's too dangerous. We've made it through tough spots plenty of times already. We'll be fine. Geet, if this is some kind of prank, then it's gone a bit too far. Enough playing around here. Come on home. Moses, look out. Moses! Senno? Uh, he's so strong. Yep. He knew exactly when to retreat, 
He has perfect control over the others, too. Senel, are you okay? I'm fine. What about Moses? He's badly hurt. That's Moses' eye patch. Moses, move your hand. I can't heal the wounds around your eye. What happened to your eye? What are you not surprised about? Red? He's unconscious. We should return to where it is beacon and reorganize, especially considering Moses' condition. Yeah. I like how this character quest more or less... almost... I don't know, it kind of revolves more around, um, Geet than it actually does Moses. But anyways, yeah. Geet's turning wild, so... What's going to happen at the end of Moses' character quest? What will happen to Moses and Geet? Oh, we don't know. But we're pretty close to the end to figure it out. I'm not going to spoil anything or make any hints at what will happen. So, anyways, as usual, I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. And I will see you all next time with some more Let's Play Tales of Legendia when we, well, figure out a little more of what's going on. So until then, I'll see you later, guys.